working out those snacks has been rough. It's been a, it's been a rough task. <laughs> How have you been, Juice? Erica! With the gift sub for Juice. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you so much. Alive? Do you... So, Juice is a friend from college. And... Last I heard... Were you... Were you okay, this, this might be me being terrible. You being a terrible friend. Are you getting... Are you getting married? <laughs> um, who told you that? I don't remember if... Okay. Alright. I didn't know. I didn't know. I was like... Because I remember someone was getting married. You are! I knew it! <laughs> Did you have a BB? Yeah, Juice just had a child, actually. Juice Jr. Not yet. Are you planning on having a child? Now, actually, serious question? Unless that's, you know, private talk. <laughs> and I guess... <laughs> I mean, eventually. That's fair. That's a good answer. You can't go wrong with eventually. <laughs> Wise decision. Wise decision. <laughs> we promote wisdom. <laughs> this chat don't don't marry and well I mean you can but like don't have kids before you're ready they're very expensive if you don't have a way to take care of them <laughs> it'll be bad for everyone that's my PSA of the day don't have kids before you're ready <laughs> I mean I don't think that will change juice I'm sorry I know it might be a, a bit of a letdown, me telling you that. But... Sometimes, some things... Just can't change. Yeah, it's a bit of a hard truth. But... And I guess especially with that, don't call your kid Tom. Because that kid's gonna be made fun of. Relentlessly. Cause that's the the Gen Z name to make fun of. I have learned. That is true. You see, but you, the thing is, you were. Were you, wait, were you planning BB? You were planning BB, right, Erica? I thought you were. And if you weren't, I'm sure then you could. You could speak to it, <laughs> to it not being the easiest thing to transition into. You weren't and were? Okay. I don't know how much... Aww. But yeah, so I'm sure, I'm sure you can, you can speak to it being interesting when you don't expect or have a plan for, for BB immediately. <laughs> You're like, uh oh, I have to take care of child. And for anyone who wasn't aware, uh, just because I was... I've been part of uh, another streamer's community, uh, Game with Nikki, although I changed her name now, uh, to Nikki Nocturna, and that's where Erica is from, that's how I met Erica. Granted, we're now friends outside of that fact. Um, and we got to accompany the whole process, which was awesome. Whole process of the wedding and the baby and the house. It was a good time. We've been there for everything. <laughs> I 
I don't think I've ever read that message. It says, you are dry again. Thank you. But yeah, congratulations, Juice. <laughs> I went. What? About being wet? No. Hopefully, well... Oh, we went to get pizza? No, yeah, we were still talking about the childs. Pizza? Wait a minute! <laughs> when you realize pizza is involved. From where? From where are you getting said pizza? By the way, what I'm doing right now in-game is I'm trying to find the second boss. Which is not explicitly chilling, like I said on the title, but, you know, when you're a streamer, you gotta clickbait, and people love the chill stream. <laughs> Nothing as clickbaity as a chill stream. Can be a chill boss, the last one kind of was. Supreme Pizza in Beverly. That's not a chain, right? That was like a, a just a, a nice local pizzeria. Or not. I don't remember. I think it's a local one. Skelly boy. Get away. It's a wet skelly boy. <laughs> I don't like wet skeletons. Let me t Okay, here's some dry skeleton. For our enjoyment. Local. Nice. Nice. I remember hearing about it. But I don't think I had ever had, honestly, at college, I don't think I've ever had pizza other than Domino's. <laughs> so. Ooh, I got it. I got the nest. Okay. Ooh, and I'm hungry. Look at this! Look at that hitbox! Look at this! Hitbox. This trash. Where's my shield? There we go. This was a strange nest. It usually has like a bunch of different stuff. This music is like more melancholy Skyrim. Yeah, it is. I love it. I can get rid of this. This is the most useless thing. Uh, I agree, and I I love it. The soundtrack to this game is it's awesome. I, I was a huge fan of uh, Breath of the Wild's approach, where it doesn't have music, but it's very strong ambient sounds, then like trickles of music here and there. But when you have something like this, where it's not, it doesn't really get in the way. It very much works for for. Um... Oh, oh! There's a lot of people here. I'm okay with it. Like, it's not getting in the way, but it's a pleasant, nice soundtrack. I just listen to Brr. Oh, there, I'm... Also, I don't know if every seagull Look at that seagull. I don't know if every um, Black Forest has a giant, or if it has more than one giant, because we last time we actually killed the giant. I wasn't expecting to do that, but hopefully there aren't more giants. <laughs> Why are there so many bad guys right next to my house? 
Ugh, the lighting in this game. Whenever this game saves, it just it just so hard. They brought cookies. You know what the worst part is? They start hitting my house and damaging it. Look at that! <laughs> They're doing it in front of my window! Get out of here! Yeah, you get out of here! Punk? This is the <laughs> only reason I built a window. <laughs> Because they keep attacking my house. So I had to build an attack window house. Attack house win. Attack window in my house. <laughs> Defense window. There you go. <laughs> That's what I meant to say. But how have you been other than that, Juice? I, honestly, other than that quick brief talk we had after one lunch. I haven't really seen you or talked to you. Period. Oh yeah, look, it's all my troll stuff. I hear them just trying to break my super expensive stuff. They're on the other side. Okay. Still working in Salem? Awesome. Awesome. You... <laughs> like, you were alright during the, the whole pandemic situation. I mean, it's still going on, but at least we're now back to some normalcy. Making coffee, making sandwich. Were you like, did your, well, I'm guessing most places closed unless they were essential. Did your job close up? You had to like take a break for a while? Does that happen to, you know, <laughs> most people, most people are just going through that. And obviously, if you don't want to disclose anything, just I'm just asking for conversation's sake. And because I'm genuinely curious, but... Please do not feel pressured. Um... Troll trophy... Troll hide? I have a place for all my hides. I have too many chests. Seed? No. We actually never had fully closed the store. Awesome. But there was a couple months where it was just the owners working. Got it. Yeah, it makes sense. It's... Probably just so hard, especially for small business owners. It was crazy. It was just so many businesses closing, which is so sad. I really think that that's one thing that should really be worked on is just the infrastructure for small business to be able to stay afloat. Obviously, hoping nothing like that will happen, but in a way that people don't have to get out of home to be able to still buy from these small businesses because otherwise only the big businesses with the online infrastructure are going to stay. Personally, I didn't work or work one day a week for a while, but now I'm actually there basically full time. Awesome. That's good to hear. That is good to hear. Yeah, no. It's, uh, yeah, I've heard from so many friends, so many people that were just like, yeah, I'm out of a job. Granted, you know, I guess stimulus checks helped, but also the job, that's the thing, right? The job isn't just making the money. I think that if you're, if you really enjoy your job, you're getting a lot of joy out of it. So that's the thing too. If you're just locked inside your house, it's like, oof. You never got one Sag? Perfect. I don't know if I can do this anymore on 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 the internet. <laughs> I actually was just reading that this might be a, a hate thing. <laughs> you can't do okay hand anymore. So I always forget, but I'm like, wait a minute. <laughs> Why are all these things bad now? Makes me sad. Anyway, tangent. 
we don't have online Ori, so big agree on the end. Yeah. And I think the problem, too, with uh, a lot of the apps, like, you can't just say, oh, yeah, they're the apps, just use the apps. They're... It's so little return for the businesses. I, you know, I'm living right now somewhere where members of the family are working in, in a restaurant that uses Grubhub and um, DoorDash. And the money that comes back from that is so little. It, unless they get, you know, a crazy amount of sale from from them, it's usually not really worth it. It does, at least it doesn't feel as an out outsider. I don't feel like, where's my bones? I don't feel like it's worth it. So when I say that, I mean like something different, not just one of those apps. So where am I putting my meats? I'm just gonna put meats here. <laughs> You're not wrong. You're not wrong. DoorDash, Grubhub take 30% sale. And yeah, like some places have a much smaller profit margin on their full price. So unless they hike up the price, it's going to be, you know. Oh, oh, Erica actually works in a really cool place. Not the... <laughs> Coffee shop isn't cool, but like, <laughs> okay, that sounds bad out of the way. Yeah, she works in a in a cropo. She works for the mouse himself. Corpo. <laughs> it was just a. Uh, it was just going along with the misspell. She's a chef at Disney. I guess it's just the... Okay, you're... She's a cook at Disney. <laughs> I remember. Hopefully I wasn't annoying, but I was asking so many questions first met. I was like, how is this like? What is that like? They were just so curious. Especially about like, how, you know, Disney treats their staff. <laughs> I think that's very interesting to know and ask. It's true. It's true. I ask the questions. That's one thing. <laughs> That's one thing that my hosts here have told me a lot. You're like, you, you, you like asking questions. You got, you Oh. Physics. You'll ask questions about anything. I'm like, yeah. Nice. Ah, no! <laughs> Died too many. This log. <laughs> hey, Kylie. Welcome. 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 Sometimes when I say welcome, I'm glad. I'm glad it wasn't annoying. <laughs> because, yeah, to me, it's just super interesting. Railing get over here. He's running away. This is a punk.
How are you doing tonight, Kylie? Doing all right? The saves in this game always scare me. <laughs> I heard something. Oh, it's not open? But you, you've been going to work. And yeah, that is a good... And that is a good question, too. <laughs> that Jesus has. I don't think I asked that question. Oh, land is in Cali. I don't think I ever asked that question. Is it? <laughs> it's tough. Because <laughs> I can imagine there are some crazy Disney fans. Like... Do you have, like, what is the craziest story you've gotten from a Disney fan? Well, of you interacting. Oh, I bet. October in Salem. <laughs> you don't want to be there. I mean, if you're a business, you want to be there, but you don't usually want to be there when things are crazy. I need to, I need to mod someone. Get. It's weird. I've never gotten ad bots like that. This is the first time. Am I finally becoming big enough that I'm getting ad bots? <laughs> yeah, I clicked it. I clicked it. Now I can't control my computer. It's interesting. Maybe if I press Alt F4. When it comes to pass holders, they're so entitled <laughs> and everything must be perfect to them because they need... I think the entitled people are so <laughs> the worst. <laughs> like... Man. I don't even know what to say. Oh, you saying that the mouse is inerrant makes me. There's this cartoon, this gross, not even a cartoon, like GIF of, <laughs> of like Mickey, but he's like massive and fat and in a vat, and these tubes are coming into him. And it's just like money or something. And it's, oh, I love that. I love that one so much. It's kind of whenever I think of Mickey, I think of that gif. <laughs> I wish I could find it, but it might be a little bit, it might not be Twitch approved. Let's just say that. Oh yeah, actually I had a few things I wanted to build. Here's the thing, whenever I'm focusing more on the conversation, I usually just forget what I'm doing for a while. <laughs> I need to see if I have enough flint, and I need- oh yeah, I need more leather. Okay, I definitely have enough wood. Um, I'm gonna make more arrows. I need more leather. And find the second boss, that's right. <laughs> that's right. Uh. Arrow, arrow. Yep, that's the one. That's the one. And yes, the mouse is already taking over the world. Buying everything. Now it was scary when Bethesda, not Bethesda, well Bethesda got bought by by Microsoft. Microsoft wants to be the the Disney of video games. Just buying everyone. Okay. I need, I need more pig skin. So I can upgrade my my stuff so I can fight the boss. If I find the boss. I guess I've never gone south. It's gonna go I Actually, I've, south is where the game started, but there's this area here I've never... Oh. Blood. Whoa. 
one leather from that? God, are you kidding me? We we have to eat juice. This is this isn't you know future land where you can find fruits everywhere and just like rely on fruits. We need meat to eat. Like it's the only way of nourishment in this game. Ooh, let me eat these mushrooms and blueberries. And kill some more pigs. <laughs> no, the enemies explode too. <gasps> deer. No, don't run away, deer. I need to kill you. Getting deer is one of the hardest things in, in this game. <laughs> Slaughter. Slaughter is just laughter with an S. Trust me. Oh. <laughs> you have a point. You have a point. I misspoke. <sighs> Look at this field. Now back at me. Uh, pig? No, that's too big to be a pig. And it's running too derpily. Oh, the wind on the grass. Mm. It's good. Am I just going around my house? <sighs> I thought it was going south. No, I'm not even going south. I'm going northeast. Ah. He's running away from me. What was the story? I don't know. Erica might not be around anymore just because giving baby a bath, but there was this one story she was telling me of because when she was pregnant, they wouldn't have her in the kitchen. Um, granted, you know, money, the Disney's a poor company, so they couldn't pay for her to, you know, not have to work throughout her entire pregnancy. But uh, what? Um, just kidding, but it's, um, she was working, I think, the, the front, like, the, she was a, a welcomer, uh, a greeter, that's, that's the word, and there, that's where she was telling me a lot of the story, like, all these really entitled people, <laughs> it was just like, oh no, I don't want to be there. I don't... I forget what it was. But... Oh. <laughs> I must understand, small indie film company. Yeah, yeah, they, they make indie films. I think they made that really small indie film about, like, uh, time travel and stuff. I think called, like, Infinity War or Endgame, you know. Totally not the biggest movie ever released. I need to go a direction that I haven't been. Keep getting distracted by animals. Ooh, a rock! <gasps> Pig! Did someone just shoot me from a distance? How much leather? Six leather? I've killed like 3,000 pigs at this point. Get... Reading. I like how he was leaving too. <laughs> he was like, oh, he's reading. 
give thanks to Frey, but I think we've read this one. Yeah. Now it's raining. So you become completely useless when it rains in this game? Oh, I'm naked too. Am I fully naked now? I don't even have my helmet on. Oh, look at this grass though. Also that little sci-fi flick. We have the they have the wars in the stars Star Trek. Yeah, some people forget the name. Star Trek. But I think Star Trek is a uh, Warner. So, yeah, they thankfully they don't have the, any of the of the Star Treks. You now the one the one with the the brother and sister that love each other. Thankfully they don't have that one. Although I've always preferred the one with Jar Jar. The Jar Jar Star Treks are the best ones. Treasure... Oh, Treasure Planet. <laughs> it's actually really good. I really like Treasure Planet. Man. I was reading the... Like, the story of how Disney canceled that like, pretty much made that movie be a failure because they didn't want to do 2D animation anymore. It was... It's so sad how that movie got just the worst of it just because it just happened to happen at the wrong time when they wanted to move away from it. It's like, man... Yeah, yeah. Such a passion project for the creators. Really was. Studios equals stinky. Yeah. It's too bad. It's too bad. This one's different. Old traveler, bear witness to my warning. Now many who have come before you carried here by Odin's will to do his work. And the path ahead is hard and dang the danger's great. Okay, we've actually... Oh, oh, oh. Hey. Um, I think we've done this boss already, because we're in the meadows, so it's talking about the meadows. Kinda sucks. I need to find that rock, but for the second boss. Also, there's a line of stones. That's the thing, too. This game, actually, the procedural generation of this map is actually really interesting. I like it. Granted, could there be better things? Like, could more things and new different things be done? Sure. But, like, I actually really like it. I think it's well done. What's this one? Yeah. I know I can train boars, but I need their skin on them. I'd love if you could ride boars in this game. Yeah, I know. A bunch of these, but these are all... So, things are divided by biomes. So, level one is meadows, and it's not a, a flat kind of sharing of the line. Sharing of the line, like, split. So... This, so far, this is all I've explored. I actually thought the island was just this, but it keeps going this way. Uh, but this was, uh, sorry, this was level one. The meadow is technically level one, so this entire area is meadow so far, and it's level one. This is level two, uh, black forest, but what I'm looking for isn't here. So the statue and the stuff, the stone for the boss, no clue where it is. This is the first boss. Supposedly in the Black Forest, there's a stone that tells you where the boss is and it shows up on the map like this. So. <laughs> Not only are there other food options. Hey, you can't tame them and get their skin. You gotta, you gotta kill them for their skin. 
Imagine if people could just give people or animals could just give their skin. I think this is the okay. just give their skin and be like, hey, here you go. You can have that. That makes things so much easier. Renewable resource. And I'm sure everyone listening is like genius idea. Good night, BB. Classic Easter gift in Germany. Oh! Have my skinzel! That's terrible. But like, you know, all of their fairy tales are all about skinning people and ladies that aren't the main protagonist of their stories. So, it works out. It makes sense. Uh oh. We're in Black Forest. Welcome to Black Forest. The weird formations of stone. So deal with this. So we're in, and you can always see what biome we're in because it says it, which is quite convenient, especially because it's not as <laughs> easily seen, I guess, as a Minecraft where it literally looks like a desert when it's a desert. It literally looks like, although like some of the just green foresty areas, I not well. I don't even know the word I want to say. But I have no idea how to differentiate them with their proper names. I'm sure the game probably tells you. Oh, Juice, you know, I actually was going to ask you this when you were talking about how you worked at a coffee shop. But... Oh! Ooh, I'm getting a message from our guest, who is saying she'll be here at 9.25. So no riots, please. It's going to be a little bit later. <laughs> so no riots. I guess that's less of just a saying nowadays, <laughs> which is kind of sad. Anyway, <laughs> what I was going to say earlier was, uh, she is making dinner with Cam. Oh. No, she's here. She's just... Yeah. Sleep? You are wet. <laughs> Thanks. Guess I should. You thought Juice was the guest? No. Although... Could be. In the future, I'm not opposed to that. If he's not opposed to that. I would not ever be opposed. Unless it just somehow turned out that he was secretly evil or something. Which is always an issue with anyone, you know? You never know if someone's secretly evil. <laughs> I have too many planned things. Quote of the day. Somehow I keep getting wood. And meat. Well, I know how I'm getting the meat. Oh, wait, how much flint do I have? Do I have enough? I do have enough flint. Do I have enough leather? 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 Where did I, was I putting my leather? Ah, here we go. 17? Yeah! 
You get two guests. That's not a problem. Loving all the rain. Loving the sound. Getting closer to it doesn't change. Um, yeah, you get two guests. Juice in the chat. Just more intro beans. Where's that emote from? Like it looks like it's from a game. And I see you use it all the time. Twenty leather scrap. Wait, twenty? How much do I have? How many do I have? Just a naked man running with a hammer. Seventeen. I need twenty. Oh, really? I honestly would not have guessed. Double the guess, double the suffering. Streamer just starts sweating. He's like, okay, gotta get everything. Kitty hype is another. I, I don't, you don't use that one as much. Uh, kitty hype. I tried picking the BTTV emotes that I thought everyone would use the most. No clue if I did a good job, but pick the ones that seemed cool. If that makes any sense. I don't want to kill that pig because that's my pig that, that I'm training, that I am indoctrinating. Speaking of indoctrination, Mass Effect! Mass Effect! Also, indoctrinate, because clearly indoctrination is not a thing outside of Mass Effect, though. So. I'm here, little piggy. Oh, yeah. You be my little piggy. Oh, here you go, little piggy. Oh, I back away now. Hamster emote. Gay hamster emote. I honestly don't even... I didn't even know that was a thing. <laughs> oh, yeah, you got... You got nope rods. Rods nope. One thing that really annoys me is that it's Rod Zero Nope. And I'm like, I just want it to be a nope. Rod's Nope. <laughs> yeah, you have to use five. Five things of your name. Honestly, don't even know that one. Oh, oh, oh! More! I can kill him! Wow, that was a one-hit kill. It's probably because he wasn't suspecting. So it's more humane. And they don't suspect anything. If you're engaged in battle with boar, and you're hurting said boar multiple times. Close, close juice, but I think it's all capital. Actually, let me check. It's capital N. Oh, it's R what? They changed it, and now it's Rod's O one. Nope. They're adding more. They're adding more letters or numbers in this case. More digits. Wait, how do you make it flat? Why does your look flat? <laughs> How do you do that? In what direction did I run? How did I end up there? I was at my house the last time I was paying attention. <laughs> you ran after a pig. That's the last thing I remember. Whoa, I didn't know that channel points could do that. Now it's thinking, though. That's awesome. <laughs> when you don't even know what your own points do. I never fully set up that system. I kind of just left it at the basic things. And now the <gasps> stone. Wait, is this Black Forest? <sighs> stupid, 
See? This is why I kill them, because they kill me first. Ugh. That's number one law of life. Someone hit you, you gotta kill them. <laughs> don't take that as advice. I don't want to be banned on Twitch. That is not condoned. We do not condone murder in real life. <laughs> Video game monster murder? Okay. Oh, look how many boars there are! Free meat, free meat. Everyone wants to be killed. Everyone is here. Da, 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 da. <laughs> this is the worst <laughs> version of Smash Bros. Everyone's just there to be killed. Like, no, please! Okay, this is getting really dark. <laughs> Not even I was fast enough for this. Ah. Well, where do you think they go when they fall off screen? Well, <laughs> given that in the lore, it's actually just a kid playing with toys from those characters. It's actually just a kid letting the toys fall off the counter. So... They don't die. They're not real. <laughs> and Master Hand and Crazy Hand are just the hands of the kid. And it's the creation rebelling against the creator. There's actually a really good game theory on that, which I really like. <laughs> nah. Hitting me with a nah. Any explanation? Nah. That's what I like. <laughs> they go to Valheim. Nice, bringing it back around. I like it. Like, it makes lore sense. It makes... Good. It's good. Oh, it's another... It's another dungeon. Wait, there totally isn't a dungeon here. Are there just two dungeons side by side? Oh no, that's this is for mining. Copper deposit. Okay, I need to mark this as copper deposit. And this is not a dungeon. So, unless there's a dungeon over here. But I don't think there is. I think I just mismarked it. Yeah, okay. Dungeon's over here. I think this is the dungeon I've already tried exploring to. No, I don't think I explored this one. Which one was I doing for dungeons? This one's for dungeons, right? Yeah, this one's for dungeons. Dungeon. <laughs> hey! Actually, I wonder if that's a thing. Oh, I'm so zoomed in. I'm playing it like God of War here. I'm gonna zoom it out a little bit. And then we can see my naked- <gasps> There's a stone and it's in Black Forest. Is this the stone I've been looking for? Please don't be the Grey Dwarfs. Alright. It is the Grey Dwarfs. Okay, it's just the same one. It is a tragedy. Oh, look, this is a cool cliff. Cliff to the water. Cool cliff. <laughs> Alright. We could build a house here. Is it far away enough from all my other houses? 
it's almost equal distance from all th other houses. This could be a thing. I don't even know why I'm going so far. I need to go back to take the leather back so I can fix my clothes. Snow! I don't think I've seen snow yet in this game. Oh no, is this a new biome? Mountain. Okay. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. This <laughs> is bad, I'm naked. Oh no. Freezing is worse than... Oh no. This is blizzard. Okay, okay, we're good. <laughs> oh. I guess there's another ecosystem on this island. I guess this island just keeps going. So initially I, I kind of... Ooh. I made my base at the shore. I, was, I could see other islands. I'm like, okay, so probably eventually I'll have to move to a different island. It didn't work. Do a high dive. I wish you could. I love when games actually have the dive animation because they look so good. It's so satisfying when you dive in a game. I want to lift a sign with a score. Just instinctive. I wonder if I can cook blueberries. Make a blueberry pie. Oh, there's water here. Is this the ocean? <gasps> oh wow, you can see the mountains in the back there. That's cool. This is... I was... I always get... I'm very much a dreamer when it comes to like ideas and projects. So, the game that I was making, which I am still kind of making, but I'm kind of on a bit of a back burner right now, um, was going to be a very simple game graphically. Uh, and of course, because I was just planning the full story for a full trilogy, I was also planning the graphics for each of them, which might not be a very realistic. <laughs> uh, but you know, you're just dreaming, you're having fun, kind of just theorizing these things. So, my idea for the, the second game would be... So the first game would be kind of like a top-down, 16-bit look. The second game would be a PlayStation 1 kind of graphics, which this approximates to in terms of textures, and I love this look. I really enjoy it, so... Anyway. That's my little game I was making, Tandy. Another thing I worry is that I've technically been all over these areas, but what if I missed the stone that tells me where it is? It's not a big stone. So how am I gonna know Missed it. had to kill him, he was eyeing me weird. Oh, it's just so nice. Especially because the house is in a clearing, it's it always gives me a homey feeling in this game when I arrive at the ki at the clearing, and it's just like, and you can see the house because it's so big. It's like, oh, 
Nice. Nice. Whoever designed this place <laughs> must have been really good. It's actually like, I'm not even talking about myself, because the town was already set up around here. So. Uh oh. Did the screen just shake? Oh no. Oh no. Okay, we gotta we gotta move. There might be another giant outside. Which is not fun. I think the screen just shooketh. Oh wait. I hear it. Okay. And the music is getting a little bit more tragic than usual. Where do I put my rocks? Oh, so many... Why do I have so many chests? Oh, he's here. I can... I can hear him. I was gonna say smell him, but thankfully no. <laughs> there are giants in this game? There are. There are giants in this game. And... They're not fun to fight. Let's just say that. <laughs> they're not very fun to fight. Okay. Hopefully I have enough wood. I always forget. Is he right outside my window? Okay. Just gonna put everything. Oh, let's go. I need to upgrade my clothes, otherwise I'm just gonna die. Upgrade my clothes. Yes. Okay, okay, okay. There we go. Nice tanning rack. Why is my bench... So hurt. There we go. Yes, I can heal my clothes. Good. Now put them back on, boy. <laughs> Don't forget your slingshot. I don't have a slingshot, but I have a bow. It's me. Uh, wait, where do I still have a fixing sign? Oh, he's right there. He's right there. Okay. Why? Why do they... I need to build a better wall around my house. This is not good. my body all my chests screw you dude You creep. <sighs> oh, I'm naked again. No, 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 no. Okay, the, well, we got our answer. That. If there are multiple of them. 
I don't like his unchanging expressionless face. <laughs> it is kind of creepy. Honestly, older games are far scarier to me than a lot of newer games. Like PS1 era games, oh, they're scary. <laughs> Those games are scary. Screw you, little lizard. How's, the, how's this guy not the boss? Screw you, little lizard! Get out of the way! Okay, okay I need to recharge. <laughs> Big giant little lizard! The duo that no one expected. By Pixar. Blue Giant and I. Little lizard. More like, it actually sounds more like a DreamWorks movie. <laughs> is that thing with no neck called neck? The thing is, it's entirely a neck. That's where. Ooh, headshot! This whole body is kind of like a big long neck. Got a bunch of troll coins, but now time to redo all of my shields. I mean, all of my whatever it's called. Chests, that's the word I'm looking for. <sighs> Dark. Eh, I'll fix my house tomorrow. <laughs> don't like that? You don't like an animal that's j all neck? <laughs> What's not to like? Oh yeah, my other pet peeve. I keep forgetting, they have a... Um, a button in the game that allows you to give feedback. I keep forgetting, there's one thing I'd... Sir? One thing that I would love to be able to do is use my hammer and my torch. But I can't do them at the same time. I just want to use both at the same time. Not too much to ask. Are all my chests destroyed? Okay, not all of them, but 99% of them. Alright. That's not straight at all. Why is it blocked? Why is it blocked? What is blocking? Oh, my body is blocking it. Okay. Oh, I was putting them backwards. Not that it really matters. Note to self. Maybe it's not such a, a good idea to have my chess in a back house like this. Because the giant can see me through my little, through the little window and can try to destroy it. I feel like I spaced these out way too much. Ah. There we go. Ah. Video games and space not having real requirements. <laughs> you know, I'm, I'm surprised you don't like necks, because I, I hear that in general humans are attracted to... The more neck you have, <laughs> the more attractive you are. That's why 
jokes are funny though. That's they do elongate the necks of models in Photoshop. That's like one of the things they do. So, you know, granted, is that something that we should strive for? I don't know. And elongated necks. Yeah. You did not know that? Yeah, they do. They stretch the necks of the... Make it longer and thinner. Of models. <laughs> Some things are just sad. <laughs> Some things are just sad. Oh, I didn't space them the same on both sides. Screw it. I'm just keeping it like this. Okay, so I use wood a lot, so I'm just gonna... Wait, or is my wood one the one that stayed? How is my wood one the one that stayed? That's crazy. Okay. Well, I'm guessing I'm gonna have to use all this wood, because... Okay, seeds were here. I remember that. I'm gonna have all my seeds back in the same place. That's my monies. Leather, I had over here. Yeah, finally learning where all my things are. I need to finish this. Okay, rich stuff. Rich stuff is over here. This goes there, that goes there. Um, not there. All my stuff for crafting. For smelting, I mean. <laughs> this just became inventory management. The game. We back. Yeah, it, it is one of the weirder things. The all the stuff they do to the models in in uh, photoshopped images. Or even just what they do to the models, like what, which things they change. It's very interesting. One of the things too is that they never make them completely symmetrical because it's too noticeable if you make them completely symmetrical. So they do always leave like a mole or like some sort of asymmetry because it's less weird. I'm gonna actually have my... I guess... I guess I'm putting my rocks back here again. This goes here. Add this here. Let's add this here, but this is like weird. I don't know what that falls under. And yeah, yeah there we go. Cleared up. Oh yeah, and I had a place for yellow mushrooms. Where's my food? Yeah, I'm just gonna put it here. Masters of Deceit and Illusion. Could be a magic uh, TV show, one of those shows that reveal how how it's made. I l used to love those shows. Even, like, debunking shows, obviously talking about Mythbusters. I used to love watching it as a kid. That was one of my favorites. <laughs> I used to come back from school as a little kid, just giddily being like, Mythbusters, Mythbusters! <laughs> I was that kid. I loved Mythbusters. Um, okay, I think we're good and I can rebuild the wall. Oh, I have to fix all my floors and stuff. They're, oh, they're in rough shape. I know I've mentioned this before, but I know how they- I love how they look more olden and broken when they're lower, uh, durability or whatever. Lower health parts. Just such a great inclusion. And it's so well done. It's not just a red, <laughs> you know, a red part. It's like, it actually looks like it's more ragged and used up.
This time, I will not make the mistake of putting a little window there where a giant can look at me from the outside. Um, I'm gonna close it. The reason I have that there is so that the smoke could escape, because this has actual smoke physics, so I need a place for the smoke to escape. Otherwise, it doesn't, and I suffocate it to death. And... This time, I'll... I'll close it, because... No more of that is neither needed back here because I don't have a fire back here anymore. But yeah, I that's just one of the things I love with this game. It's the little attention to details that they have. It's I don't know, I, I love it. I think it's very smart and well thought out. Yeah, I'll just leave it like this. An even bigger window. Do you like smoke physics? Yeah. No, this game is nice. Again, like, I love how... Not contradictory, but... What, what's what's that word when things are... Are just... They're not... They don't seem to go together, but... Anachronistic. I don't know if that's the one I want. It means that, but I don't know if that's the one I want for this situation. But I like the mixture of old graphics, of older graphics... Mixed with, uh... New state-of-the-art... Uh, effects. I think it looks really cool. Just juxtaposition, that's right. Haven't had to use that word in so long. Forgot juxtaposition. I guess I left it open too because it was like a little... A little... Sun... Light entrance, but I guess it doesn't really matter. It's actually lit the same. So... And another cool thing for anyone who wasn't here before... Is that you also have to make sure everything is properly supported. That's why you see green. Things that are not... As well supported, I don't think I can find one. They're, they become yellow and red, which I love. The little bridge builder lover in me loves that color coded magic. Alright. Come in. Hello! How's it going? Good, how's streaming? It's good. Alright. Who's on the stream? We have quite a few people. Oh! Five people watching. Oh, yes! Uh, so... We are getting right here. Oh, we can start putting stuff on. Maybe we should do cups, because these are a little more bougie. Yeah. I was uh, about to get the teacups. Mm-hmm. That would be too much, though. For the first time, you know? <laughs> <laughs> So, let me switch over here. Give us just a few seconds to set up. Get the chair. Yeah, get the chair. 